What's happening? I'm suspicious. There's a cutscene going to happen, isn't there? And I don't think it's going to be something good. Alright, it's their infiltration. Hail Hydra! Well done, sir. And with that, I believe we are ready to proceed. Voice acting! Let us be about our business then. The next patrol may not be so credulous. Let us leave him out in the open pretty much. <laughs> Why must you be so disappointingly brusque? You're not at all as Min Filia described, you know. I don't think you've favoured me with so much as a single compliment since we set out. Tell me, did your time in the wilderness sap you of all your charm? Or are you holding it in reserve for your beloved? This is neither the time nor the place. Well, call me old-fashioned, but when I'm risking life and limb infiltrating an Imperial Castrum, I like to be sure of my comrades' motivations. I see now where Alphino gets it from. <laughs> Minfilia is dear to me, it is true, but not in the way you think. Fifteen years passed, when she was still but a child. There was an incident at a parade. A gubu broke free of its fetters and ran amok through the streets of Uldar. Had I been more attentive, I could have prevented it. But I was distracted, and her father was killed. And there's an actual pronunciation, gubu. I feared she would never recover. But in the years that followed, she showed herself to be more resilient than I had ever imagined. And when she learned of her gift, she did not flinch from the responsibility, but sought to guide others on the path. She touched the hearts of all around her. Mine, Louis Soir, every science. In those dark days following the calamity, she was our guiding light, our hope for a brighter future. She had so many dreams, and I would give anything to make them come true. My apologies. I can see she means the world to you. I did not mean to pick at old scars. No harm done, I assure you. But fair is fair, my lady. What is Minfilia to you? You mean you don't know? Only my dearest friend. When I finally emerged from my torpor, I learned that Neri a day had passed without her asking after me. She never gave up hope. And neither will I. Then for Minfilia's sake, let us pray that these vestiges of Hydaelyn's intervention will lead us to her. She does seem to have a way with technology. Alright, back to the long teleport place. See you in an hour! <laughs> a lot of people seem to think that there's a, a something between the two of them. Between Kryl and Thancred. We'll see whether or not it's just people wanting there to be love interests. It just, so far, seems like two people being playful. Or rather, Kryle being pray playful. Playful. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's great you'd be back in the tall. Oh, he even smells like adventure. Home at last. I must make my rounds to see who remains. It feels good to be home again. To think that everyone is waiting for us just beyond these doors. Friends and family with whom we have shared so much. 
Oh, gods help me, but the older I get, the more sentimental I become. Come, let us not keep them waiting. Speak to the scions of the rising storms. Oh, I know what I can do. After each quest, I'll, that's when I'll change the minions. Sorry, random thought just came to my mind. Oh, everyone's moved. Nothing to say? Is the Lady Full Hartman I... Is that the Lady Full Hartman I've heard so much about? Well, well. I shall have to introduce myself. Oh, and I think that person likes him. That's cute. And there at last. And there they are at last. Thank the Twelve. Nothing like a homecoming to lift everyone's spirits. Thanks for bringing them back, Alex. We must tell the children at once. They've always once been so fond of Hori. When our comrades betrayed us, I feared all was lost. How wrong I was. Elaine! Ephemi! It fills my heart with joy to see you both hale and healthy. Uh, and what of Higiri? She is well, though abroad on a mission at present. It just wasn't the same without you. Welcome back, my lady. Anyone here? Nope. Oh, we can do more with more of that around here. Old fell reunions with Star Wars companions bring a <laughs> bring a bloody cheer to my eye. <laughs> what a drunk. I worry about Ergamos. He's getting a bit carried away, but I suppose I can overlook it on this occasion. First Orca, and now Hori. A passing fancy I could suffer, but this, she's hopeless, utterly hopeless. All right, we'll get to that in a second, I wager. I, I have heard it all from Elaine. So, where is she? If I am to greet the songstress of Uldar, I will do so on my feet. The secret to... The, uh, to s secret oneself in a ship pearl to secure a safe passage to a faraway land. This is a tale we know all too well. When they were are well rested, I sh should like to seek... A formal introduction. Why well, wait, my friend? Come, there's no need to be shy. Pray grant me a moment longer at least. Though I am happy to oblige you, my legs are rather less accommodating. Huzzah! He's returned! Together, my brother and I shall serve... Serve the science till the breaking of the eighth dawn. Oh my! Decisions, decisions. Oh, God's sake. Orca, what in the seven elves drove my little brother, brother to come to more donor? Why you, brother? You and the science, of course. For a thousand days I trained, that I might grow as strong as you, that I might fight alongside you. Yet... Now that you are here, I sense that you have surpassed me once more. No, do not tell me. You trained with the Hanish, did you not? Oh, your eyes do not deceive, brother. Oh, I, I, I have studied the trials of the Braves and drunk deep the, of the souls of my enemies. An unexpected but welcome reunion indeed. And a challenge besides. It would not 
do to be bested by my little brother? Oh no, not after having come in so far. So we now have, I realise that that's the DPS caster outfit, which I just didn't recognise it. So we've got a DPS caster, a healer, and a tank. So that's one of everything. And I realised that you can talk to everyone once more after they've said the thing. Twelve be praised, so many are still with us. Brilliant, bloody brilliant. Blech. I know I could try burping, but no, I'm just going to go bleh. Isildur has the spirit of a man half his age. I imagine his granddaughter often struggled to keep up. And last but not least, call the net. Glad though I am to be home, I cannot help but think of those who have yet, yet to return. Once we have settled in, I will join the search. We all must do our duty, and I am no exception. Our brothers and sisters are counting on us. Speak with Tataru. So long since I've seen them all like this. Too long. Ah, <sighs> twas the chaos born of my foolish ambitions which forced them to flee. Though they are returned, there are others yet missing, others whom we cannot forsake. We'll find them, Elfino! I know we will. Menfila, Ida, Papalimo, every last one. And when they walk through those doors, we will be here, here to welcome them home. With me at the head of the queue, of course. Cookie! Do 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 cookie! And since we've hit that. Oh yeah, we'll cart in here. I'll do it outside. Oh, we got a minion, and apparently we're already going into the new dungeon. That I thought it would be much further. The word of the mother, which if you couldn't tell, that's the anti tower. Alfino is eager to return to the search for Mintfilia. Thank Cred and Kryl, contact contacted us a short while ago. It would seem their foray into Castrum Meridianum bore fruit. They asked that we rendezvous with them and Yoshtola in Adelshire, where they will shine, find, share their findings. Rude though it is to depart without speaking to our guest of honour, I expect you will forgive me if I return with her daughter. Bye. Ba, ba. What are you still doing here? They're waiting for you in a deal shire. I never pronounced that the same. Uh, mayhaps it is best I, that I remain ignorant of the details. Otherwise, I might be tempted to do something rash. Ooh. I will place my faith in, all, in you all and the twelve to see her return to me. Now that Lady Full Harmon and the others have returned, we can redouble our efforts to find Ida and Papalimo. If only we had some inkling of where they went when they left Pearl Lane. A shame that Higiri was not here to welcome Lady Full Harmon home. Still, it shall be a pleasure to see the look on her face when she returns and learns of her homecoming. Is anyone else over here? You say anything yet? Nope. We will keep things running smoothly while you are away, sir. You should devote all your attention to searching, searching for the missing sires. Yeah, you say that. I'm still going to go and talk to everyone first. I know, I know. I will look after him and see that he's fit for duty. But time everyone came back to the tow. Though there's still a few missing, like young Wilred. Been too long since that boy and I had a drink. I'm sad to say I actually think he might be dead. 
I hope I'm wrong. Lately, I've been practicing calisthenics every morning to stay loose and limber. In fact, I think I might be fit to venture out into the field once more. A warrior should not boast or brag his accomplishments. So, I was taught by my father and by his father before him. Yet, I must admit that I delight in hearing the young ones tell of their adventures, their eagerness, their boldness. It is, a comf it is comforting and inspirational both. When the time comes to reclaim, reclaim what, I, what was lost, I know they will rise to the challenge. But I don't understand. I was the healer on those expeditions. How could she have... Oh my God! I was sleeping less than ten forms away. I... Oh, I have no sister. For goodness sake, woman. Looks like Oreo's off to a smashing start. Perhaps I... I should leave them to it and set about being social myself. Besides, I'd rather not be around when those... These two rising stones begin to clash. Ugh. Perceptive as ever, brother. Aye. Aynor and I have taken part in many a mission together. And though adversary have forged... And through adversary have forged unbreakable bonds. Indeed, a skillful ministrations have provided much comfort. Hmm. Why not both? For God's sake. But enough about me, brother. What of your escapades? And what of this fetching young lady? And what of this fetching young lady with whom you seem so well acquainted? Ugh. Alright, let's get out of here quick. Oh, wait, no. Get a free teleport. Oh, rendezvous with Kryl. Ugh. This one's taken a bit of a while. Is it because I'm coming from Mordor now? Alright, so let's change to... Let's go backwards there. So we'll go with Garuda next. Okay, so we need to go... Ah, right there. Do, 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 do. Bum, 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 bum. Oh no, everyone else was there. Ah, hopefully we can talk to them after. My apologies, I seem I am the last to arrive. So, what news have you for us? Well, as we postulated, they were in... They were indeed what appeared to be the remnants of an unexplained disturbance in the ether at the scene of the Ultima Weapon's destruction. A ripple at odds with the... presiding pattern. Though faint, the wave's forms bore a strong resemblance to those observed following the destruction of the... Isle of Val, when I believe Heidelin shielded me with the blessing of light. To confirm our readings, I paid a visit to Sildi to the Sildi Aqueducts. Though we detected the safe waveform, but orders of orders of magnitude larger, as one would expect of a more recent disturbance. Heidelin, there is no other explanation. But there is more. When I studied the site where Yashtola used flow, it appeared there was not not two, but three beings that been infected. Had been affected, not infected. Yet, unlike Yashtola and Thancred, there was no trail to follow. Our unknown third party was simply there and then not there. Now, recall your visions of a vast crystal floating in the sea of ether. Though this is, too is but a theory, studies of gist gifted subjects suggest that when communicating with Hydaelyn, we briefly leave our bodies behind. 
So let us consider the fa facts. One, Heidelin inter interceded. Two, a third being was caught in Yashtola's flow and vanished without a trace. And three, Heidelin may have the capacity to summon the consciousness of gifted individuals to her side. You are implying, I take it, that Heidelin guided Minfilia into the compass of my magic? That she might sum summon her body and soul into the ethereal sea? In which case, we must needs continue our search there, for a blessing, the means to do so already exist. I speak of the Anti-Tower, a Charlian construction conceived to provide scholars a vantage point over the ethereal sea. Though I do not know where its entrance lies, we need only ask its custodian. A, a contrary old crone who, for another blessing, refused to join the Exodus. Master Matoya was the keeper of the Anti-Tower? I had no idea. Then our course is clear. We must petition her aid at once. Or once again. Yay, I'm so glad Matoya's back in. I really like her character. And of course, everyone's gone, so I can't talk to them. Yeah, I'm halfway between the crystal and yeah. Running might be quicker, slightly. Do, 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 do. Bum. Bum, ba ba dum, bum, bum, bum. Ah, click locks! Do, 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 bum, 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 ba bum. To Matoya! Which isn't marked on the map, which is kinda bad. I mean, I know where I'm going, but it's been a while since you've been to Matoya's cave, so you might have wanted to mark it on the map or something, maybe. Actually, I wonder what happens when you map. Yeah, that really does not help in the slightest. I don't like it when they do this. They should always show the connecting path. Because, though, if you've been... Well, if you're playing this point, you've obviously been playing for a long time. You should really... Bloody turtles. You should know at this point generally where everything is. But it has been a long time since you've been here. Is it here? I believe so. Yes. Do 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 do. Bum 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 bum. Ba da 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 da. Come on, voice acting, voice acting, voice acting. Damn, 